the Great Spark. What's up guys, Crazed here with a gameplay for you on Battle Creek on Master Chief Collection and I'm playing with the Elite Assassin. Always enjoying playing with him, lots of fun and of course just good humored uh, player and a really good YouTuber. I'm really uh, enjoying his content that he uploads. Um, of course he does Halo and he does a bunch of other things, does some gears and uh, recently the, uh, what's the other game, Monster Hunter World. So I enjoy those as well. Um, really enjoy playing with them at, at any time, of course. But onto the subject that I had in mind today, and uh, I recently saw a post over there on the uh, Master Chief Collection forums, and it was kind of interesting. Uh, somebody actually asked the question, Master Chief Collection, is it worth it in 2018? Well, that's kind of an interesting question, I thought. Huh. If I had no idea what Master Chief Collection, other than it's Halo, and that we have a new game coming out, we don't know when, but we have a new game coming out, would Master Chief Collection be worth it to me? And to be perfectly honest, I absolutely would have to say yes, yes indeed. Uh, if you are not into multiplayer, the campaigns alone are worth it. Uh, you've got incredible campaigns, everything is in 60 frames per second, uh, 1080p, uh, <laughs> I mean, it's just absolutely beautiful to go through those campaigns again. And personally, I'd love to see Reach. Reach get that treatment with the 4K treatment, because you know that's coming. That's got to be coming in March. Yeah, I don't think they've officially said it, but we kind of know it's coming. Uh, when? I don't know. Uh, so you get the campaigns. You get to go through every single one. Hello, get all your way so I can get through and do some killing. <laughs> Anyways... The campaigns alone are worth it, and of course you got Halo CE, Halo 2, Halo 3, Halo 3 ODST, Halo 4, and Spartan Ops. Believe it or not, Spartan Ops is there, and it's still fun to play. Uh, it's, yeah, you know, I, I like the, the 5 through 10, I believe, is, uh, or is it 6 through 10? 6 through 10 uh, episodes are uh, the best, but the, uh, the original ones are pretty good, too. Um, I do enjoy that. I absolutely have fun playing that, especially if I'm playing with friends. And it's just it's just incredibly fun. Um, I really would have rather have had a firefight. I mean, a real firefight. Uh, not some of this other stuff that we've had. Uh, but I think uh, it would still be incredibly fun to have uh, to uh, go back through there. And that's just the campaigns. And then you get the multiplayer. Yes, the multiplayer at this time is a little wonky. Uh, it's... It's functional, absolutely, because I, I don't have a problem getting into matches pretty much on any playlist other than the fact that I play late at night, and usually when I play late at night, there's just not a whole lot of population, so sometimes I have issues with that. But in general, I'm in a match pretty quickly. Um, I wouldn't say, like, Halo Reach quickly, but uh, pretty quickly nonetheless, because I played Halo Reach again, too. And it's just amazing how fast you get into matches. And even today, you go in and play Halo Reach, you can guarantee you'll be in a match within 30 seconds, even to a minute, and you'll be into a match. Or at least in the lobby where you're all lobbied up and starting to vote for whatever it is you want to play. So absolutely. Uh, it's not that fast, but it's still... Uh, you get matches pretty quickly, and sometimes you have to back out and, and go back in, but... Other than that, man, it's actually really incredibly fun. Um, as for Halo 2 Anniversary, uh, <laughs> that, that is actually an amazing little playlist. I, I really like playing that. I got a nice game of Ricochet the other day. Look at that. It's like fireworks, except with needlers. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, so, honestly, I would have to say, if you have not bought Mass Chief Collection... Uh, it is definitely worth it, even in its state right now, it is worth it. And we got the updates coming sometime soon. We don't know officially when, and um, yeah, it's only going to make things better, we hope. Uh, we've heard that before with the Master Chief Collection. It's going to be better. And then you get it, and then it's like, uh, it's not better. Matter of fact, it's worse. What did you do? <laughs> So, yes, but it is a complex game. You've got to remember how many engines this thing is actually running. This is, uh, 
I want to say like six engines uh, at uh, not at a given time, but it's it's cycling between all these engines, uh, game engines, just to, to make this thing work. And it's actually a really incredible feat. And if they do get it fixed where it's actually really good and runs really smooth, I think honestly, uh, the Master Chief Collection is probably one of the best innovations of all-time gaming history. Uh, you know, I would love to see something similar in other games, uh, say like uh, Call of Duty or something. Uh, like not not like all of them, but you know I'm talking like the Black Ops series. And they say, oh, we're just going to do a Black Ops anthology, and you just can play every single one. I mean, that would be just incredible. That would be that would be a really incredible feature uh, in in a game, and I would definitely think about purchasing that. I wouldn't be happy about that Black Ops 3 though, but you know, uh, that's the way it goes. But honestly, if it do get or if it does get pulled off and it works really well, I think it is going to be an incredible achievement uh, in gaming. Let's see if I can't get them. I think we're close to the end of the match here. So hopefully you enjoyed my little thing here. And I do say, uh, if you have not bought Mass Chief Collection or you're thinking about buying Mass Chief Collection, I would definitely uh, check it out. I think it's on the Game Pass. I'm not sure. If it's on the Game Pass, you can try it out for free for 14 days because uh, got a Game Pass got a trial. Um, so definitely worth trying out. You might have to wait a day to download because it is kind of a massive game. But you're talking uh, one, two, three four five like five different games on one so yeah yeah it's it's a pretty big download so hopefully uh you check that out and uh, uh give it a go man because absolutely it's worth it and then with the updates it's only going to get better so that's the craze that's my thoughts uh i hope i answered that question and i don't know if you're ever going to see it but hey that's how it goes <laughs> All right, thanks for watching, guys. This is Crazed. I'm out of here.